This is Raquel Cardenas of Mariachi Corazón de Texas giving us a preview of Viva Mexico. It's one of the biggest events held by the M. Esparientos Mexican American Cultural Center. Viva Mexico is really important because it represents the Latino experience in Austin. It represents history, community, and culture. Olivia and her team have been working without an actual center. The MAC is under renovations. We're actually adding two whole wings. So if you've seen the MAC building, it's kind of a semicircle, and that semicircle is growing. It's in a really prominent place, right in the Rainy Street neighborhood, right next to Lady Bird Lake. The new building will have more performances, a dedicated new gallery, state-of-the-art classrooms, art studio space, and even a culinary space for learning about Mexican cooking. The Rainy Street area was the original Mexican-American neighborhood in Austin, and it's really important for us to keep that history. The upgrades won't be finished until early 2025, which means you'll see the MAC programming in other areas of Austin. It's important for the MAC to maintain our visibility. So Viva Mexico is an opportunity to have those conversations and explain, you know, kind of the history of Mexico and also what independence means for Latinos in Austin today. Raquel providing you with a small taste of the music you'll hear at Viva Mexico tomorrow. It all starts at 5 p.m. It's a free event. This year's celebration is at Pan Am Park in East Austin. You can expect live music, dance performances, lots of family-friendly art activities, and a vendor market. And Viva Mexico is just one of many Hispanic Heritage Month celebrations happening here in Austin. We have a list at cbsaustin.com. Lots of great activities for the families through next month. Go check it out. I'm John Carlos Estrada, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.